Good morning, boys and girls. This week, we have been learning about letter F. Fruit starts with the letter F. Can you make the sound with me? <sighs> letter F. So today, we are going to be making ice pops, otherwise known as popsicles, using fruits. And guess what? A little bit of veggies. What you're going to need for your popsicles is some kind of a mold. I have a silicone mold here. I have either a baggie or you can use a cup, a reusable cup, a Dixie cup, pour your contents in and stick a popsicle, stick right in the middle and throw them in the freezer. Next, you will need your fruits. We have strawberries here. It's about a cup and a half of strawberries, some frozen and some fresh. We have yogurt, vanilla yogurt. Feel free to use plain or whatever you have at your house. We also have about a cup of watermelon. We have a quarter cup of apple juice and we have a tablespoon of lemon juice, fresh squeezed, as well as about half a cup of spinach. Now, you're thinking, what is this woman doing putting spinach in a popsicle? Is she crazy? Guess what? It's super good for your body and you won't even taste it. Next, you will need your helper. This is my son, Destin. He's also in preschool. He is going to help me place all the ingredients into the blender. And since I'm the grown up, I get to press the blender button, not Destin, because it keeps him safe so he won't get hurt. Ready, son? Yes, I am. All right. My so we're going to get yes. started here. The first ingredient we're going to put in is we're going to put in the strawberries. Destin, can you grab the strawberries, please? The whole container. And dump it in. And there you go. Next, we need Destin to grab the spinach. Destin, can you dump it in, please? Perfect. Now we need Destin to grab the watermelon. It has seeds in it. It does, but guess what? They'll be pureed. Dump it in. Fabulous. Next, we need Destin to grab the lemon juice and dump it in. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Now we need Destin to carefully pick up the apple juice, very carefully, and dump it in the blender. Two hands. Beautiful. Now Destin is going to scoop in some yogurt. Can you scoop some in for me? Big scoops. Now that we have all of our ingredients, it's the adult's job, your mom or your dad or your older brother or sister's job to operate the blender. Here we go. Ooh. And let's make a milkshake. Let's make a milkshake. This can either be a smoothie or it can be a popsicle. We're making popsicles today. Right. Mm. Are you up? Oh, there's your mixture. Now you need to get your containers ready, your molds, your cups, your baggies, whatever you're going to use to make your popsicles. And now you're going to pour your contents into them. Now Destin is going to try very carefully to pour the ingredients into our funnel and into the mold. Keep going. Keep tilting. We're almost there. Keep going. There it oh. goes. Keep going. It's going to fall. Keep going. I'll tell you when it's to stop. And stop. So, we poured all of our pureed fruit and vegetable into our containers, and we were able to make eight ice creams popsicles, fruit sickles, smoothie sickles, whatever you want to call them. It's a super healthy treat made using fruits and vegetables and 100%
fruit juice. So it's guilt-free and super delicious to eat on these hot days. Because y'all, let's be real here, it's been burning up lately. So here's the finished ice pop. It's one we made a couple of days ago and this is what they look like. Super delicious and guilt-free for a yummy, yummy cold snack on a hot day. We hope you enjoy your ice creams or your smoothies, guys. Bye. See you later. Peace.